Greetings, everybody. It's Red Hunter. Welcome back to another episode of Europa Universalis 4 with Giant Man. We're uh, <laughs> dealing with a little bit of over extension, but it's not a big deal. Uh, we're going to pick up. Which, by the way. Let's go uh, sit and show here. Yeah, I'm sure there won't be like rebellions or anything. So it's it's fine. We won a middle one more. Uh actually a, a pretty big one. But it's not that big. One that Ming broke apart last episode, so one in the middle of beating the ever living shit out of Ming because that's what we do. I'd like to think that we're at least partly responsible for the fall of Ming because. We, we beat them in multiple wars and took their shit. So, I like to think that we... Look, man, there's, there's, no, there's no issues with separatists, okay? They're not gonna separate. That's, that's, that's crazy talk. That's sep separating its quitter talk. And we don't... We don't quit. You're getting wrecked. Like, wrecked hard. It occurs to me, too, if I want to take provinces from... No. Where are you headed? You... You can't stay there. Again, it's fine. Whoa, hey! Who are you? Where are you? You fucking dare to enter a military coalition against me? Took fucking long enough for one to form. This is definitely interesting then. Congratulations, you guys just became my next targets. It is so nice of you to volunteer. It's you guys didn't want to wait your turn, I have apparently. Oh, I didn't even notice this was. I even noticed this was finished. I know. It sucks for you guys because. You know. but innocent bystanders in the war against Ming. Hey, we have a military coalition against us. Cool. Cool. Is this because of our overextension? Or what? Did we finally piss enough people off? You know this military coalition is not going to fire, right? You guys have to know this. Like, you, 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 you would be insane. I'll, I'll kill all of you. I'm not going to kill all of you anyway, but, you know. One second, please.
Okay, sorry about that. Let's continue crushing everything. Ah, uh, Timmy's are the first big people to do it. Not that it's going to make a damn bit of difference, but... I wonder why suddenly we're getting military coalitions. All these times we crush these people and it's just like, nobody, they didn't give a shit. And now, now we're getting a military coalition. It is puzzling. But, these are all about to flip and then We'll be all right. It's fine. See? No issues. I think I, I would rather have the extra merchant. Work on my trade. Pause. Trade. We want you to transfer trade power. Start pulling it towards here. And we can purchase an ability, which we should do. Uh, actually. Now, let's do ship trade power propaga uh, propagation. It's fine. Not counter espionage, but fabricate a claim on here. All right. We have been, uh, I think it might be time pretty soon to, to end this war. Should I worry about the military coalition? No, I don't think so. Anyway, I don't think they're ever. I don't think it's ever going to fire. We don't care about that. gentlemen here yeah I mean something along these lines we're not even fighting in Korea I'll give it you know what let's go Let's go land in Korea. Oh, my troops are being used. Okay. You know what? I got you in doubt. I don't even think we care. Yeah, we'll do something like this. I, it is cute to me that you guys think that that you think that this military coalition is gonna is gonna do a damn thing. Yeah, 
Let's go crush this army. Because that's what we do. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's fine. Does this coalition even have a military capable of fighting me? I doubt it. Let's move. Yeah, let's go set in Korea and, and conquer shit. Well, actually, before we go to Korea. So here's what I'm thinking, Ming. I'm thinking something like this. 139, yeah, we got enough. Something like this, maybe. 100% here, there we go. This is going to upset a few people. But, ask me if I care. There was no more point of fighting. Uh, we don't need to do that. What we need to do is... Kill this rebel. Um, oh, we can have rivals. Who else can we rival? Oh, cool. Let's rival Austria and Spain. Yeah, I know I have exiled armies. Uh, who is my next target? You, possibly? Yeah, let's go here. Which, by the way, core all of this. Let's go to diplomacy. No, I don't want to change it. I want to. Want to go to Austria? So you guys are actually going to attack me, or we're just going to sit here and look at each other? I mean, because... Or should I attack you? That'll be a fun war. There you go. Now you guys have reasons to pull together. You're welcome. Wait, you already both hate France. Never mind, you don't have any extra reason to pull together. Uh, 
Could start a golden era, but why? Here's the interesting part we're getting to the point where we can start fighting. I mean, Temis aren't European yet, but we're getting there. We're marching our way towards Europe. What, who? Yeah, yeah. Should I? Hold on. Pause. Should we? Should we kill you before we don't have? We have a truce with you for two years. Okay. We can't. You can't. I was gonna say kill you before you join the coalition, but you'd be in the coalition already if. Just out of curiosity, what's our aggressive expansion with you? We have an aggressive expansion map, right? Let's take a look at the aggressive expansion map. One sixty one, one thirty six, one forty three. 268 76 that's not so bad look man Mongolia doesn't care I mean you guys care a little bit Well, sorry, my aggressive expansion is starting to spread outward. Even the Ottomans care. Well, care is a strong word, but it'd be a fun war against the coalition, right? I think I can win it. and send Austria an insult. No, it's relations actions that scornful insult. Sure. And let's send Spain an insult. You guys are fine. Like, nobody, nobody's rising anywhere. against me you are against you are in the coalition against me boo
Ah, uh, well. Not, you're not allowed to just roam free of my borders. That's not how this game works. You get to die as a result of your actions. limits am I at 194 or 195 say was I can probably I can mop all my forts for more money it's fine oh wait shit I lied
You're fine. That was a bit of a rookie mistake. Anyway, what if we decided... I know, crazy, right? But... So, I mean, that's, that's a few enemies. But we could probably... few people. It's a bit of a coalition. I mean, I'd probably be okay. It's fine. It's not a big deal. We can work on our force limit. We really need to... Oh, it's plus 20%, not plus 50%. It's... The coalition's a little bit of a problem. I'm gonna have to attack it eventually. So, uh, should we, should we use mercs? Should we should continue to use mercs, or? It's probably fine. We need to, we need to get closer to the front lines. Put you here. The attack when it comes is not going to come from. Woo! I don't think. Improving relations is going to do a damn bit of good, but we can try it. I will right, we'll lose the Diplo power. Keeping at my force limit will help. But... I think standing down for a bit will help as well. Unless... Is there anybody I can attack? 
it's not in a coalition against me, a unit coalition. How big is this coalition? Let's pick up the inflation. So everyone we don't have a truce with. Great. Is in the coalition against us. So, what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to fight somebody that doesn't have any sort of... Now what we want to do is we want to we want to mop all of our forts and drop army maintenance to like something like this. They're going to join a coalition, I'm sure. Although. Are they not? I was gonna say they they would have to. I think what I've gotta do is I've gotta wait for war to break out. The real problem with the one I need to attack is the Temis, but they've got the coalition members are not going to peace out. I could just give them a hundred, but that's going to peace everybody out around me. I think what I should do is. What? I don't have subject company, uh, countries. I better not. What the hell? Who are you? How are you? How are you a subject? I don't want you. Here's what I think. I think I need to... Good God. Let's move towards legalism. Now we're at max. We're getting the devastation. 
Um, National Talks Metal Fire is fine. Let's fabricate this claim. Fabricate claim. We need Temmie to leave. Maybe if we improve relations with you, you'll leave. Quartz is in the coalition that we can improve relations with. I don't think you're going to leave though, I don't think it matters. But it is something to do with our diplomats, so... Time we can pay off our loans and you know what we can do, and then we just do this. helps. I don't think this is going to matter, but... Because we can't get them above because of the evasion, but... I mean, this is a little bit of a problem, but we're not going to sit here and pretend it's not. But here's what I feel like. I feel like this coalition's only going to get bigger. I think that I should be the one to fire the co coalition. It's pretty bad. Government capacity means I should be able to It's just slowing my growth. We gotta get some people out of this coalition. We'll see if it's even possible. There is always there is always grief people.
or these people to attack. be that guy but you know what is the liberation act I mean that's That's nice. Let's pick this up. Tragic is exactly right. Okay. I don't think this is going to make a damn bit of difference. I think I'm going to have to attack this coalition. The good news is we're we're significantly ahead of them militarily. Yeah, it's not going to make a damn bit of difference. Is it the Timurits I should attack, or is it somebody else? I mean, we could take the capital fort. It's not a I think I do have to Wait a second. If I declare and if I declare and they don't declare on me, it won't be a show superiority war, which means that I can just I can ninja strike. What I need to do is I need to wait until the Timmies are at a war with somebody. Possibly the Ottomans or something. Hmm. This is an interesting balance of power. Poland, Austria, and the Ottomans all hate each other. Just wait for the aggressive expansion to bleed down. I 
mean, it'll be a while, but then, in the meantime, I can put up manufacturers and stuff. Sixteen, so sorry. I think that uh, I think we're stuck for the moment. No, I've, I've got to declare a regular war and hope it works. But we'll do that in the next episode because I have a feeling this war is going to take a while. We're going to have to... My plan is... My plan is to ignore the damage that they're doing, that the coalition is doing. Let my forts ride. Um, not that I have many in this area, but let them ride. And hope for the best. Wait, it's a mission, by the way. At least 20. Oof. We could complete this mission first. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, the cloth ones are gonna give me a ton of money. I should have done already. <sighs> it feels like Extend a monopoly. That way we can revoke them. Let's yeet some land from the estates as well. Oh, that one's fine. Fine, you'll be pissed, but you know, you'll get over it.
these guys seem like the right people to attack for this. If we can surround them. This is how I think I'm going to do this. But in the meantime, let's sort by income. Yeah. Trade stealing is good. Development cost, and what do we get? Land maintenance modifier? That's good. Alright, hold on. Are you fucking kidding me? Alright. Bring up army maintenance. You guys are just gonna sit here? That's fine. the right idea, but I think that's the best way to break the coalition up. your entire nation now? Oh shit, I can see your entire nation now. Well, 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 well. You're allied with them. You're allied with them. You're only allied with two people. Who else are you allied with? Over here. Okay.
You understand the meaning of the word fucked. You cause you're about to. Let us go. I should leave the military coalition against me because The one I want to attack most is the Temis, because attacking the Temis gets me closer to uh, closer to Europe, which is what I want to do. I I don't care about people's local opinions. Turn off what's on. The other thing too is we're going to need you over here. We want to take out these guys. We want to take like these provinces so we can attack here as well. We're getting there. <laughs> Not that we're uh stocking on the border for any reason, particular reason or anything. Okay. We gotta pick up some leaders. For you. For you. For you. fact go to war with I'm I'm happy to go to war with you guys We're gonna have to go to three speed while we get everything set up, but it'll work. Oops. Hi. 
How is my army professionalism, by the way? Should not, should be pretty good. I like how they do the modifiers here. Okay, time to kill the Timmies. We're gonna take... Sure. They won't help you. Cool. Oh no. Siege guy, right? Who? Where's our next fort? There's a fort there. Where's another fort? Over here? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, something like this. Ah, uh, I don't. Whatever. We'll gain the prestige. It's fine. Why are you allied with the Timurids when they've taken a bunch of your shit? Doesn't make any sense. Either way. Let us continue. You 
know what? Can we just... I bet if we... Yeah, let's do that. I don't even need to. there was any doubt of this but We're just gonna crush everything. Everything. Side merchant, we should fix that. Yeah, yes, we definitely want to do that. We should fix the uninside merchant. Where are our? I want to go ahead and call this episode here as well. Uh, no, so. is already pushing trade here what we need is somebody to push trade further 
it's actually probably fine. No transfer more trade power, but that's not where the majority of trade is going to come from. It's going to come from like back here. like this way. goes directly here so we do need to expand in this area for no other reason than then pull more trade power well, it shows a way that if you that'd be a cool thing for an expansion but like if you accrued enough trade power in an area you should be able to make it a center of trade like Wanna, you should be able to you should be able to flip in nodes throughout the game. I realize that would make trade more complex, but it would also make trade more realistic and dynamic. Because if we're the economic center of the world, I'm not saying we are, but if we were, then trade should flow through us. Not it shouldn't flow through Venice and England just because a European focus game and Janelle as well. Just a thought. Let's go ahead and pause while we catch up with what we're doing. I mean, that's the reason one of them watched the, uh, on one of the previous patches, the AI was like freaking fork crazy. I don't know, like, fork in every province, it was, it was crazy. But. The coalition dissolved, you guys should have attacked me, that you would have lost, but at least you would have a fighting chance. I'm not so sure they would have lost, but... Now would be a good time for them to attack. How, by the way, Crimea, how are you doing considering the fact that you... Turn down the Ottomans generous offer. What the fuck are you? How are you doing? Not great.
not great at all. Assuming Russia that you and the Ottomans. Oh. Timmy is going to be my gateway into Europe. So it's going to be cool. About how much of this I'm going to be able to take. I may, <laughs> I may try to cut like a straight line through. See how far I'm looking at. I may try to cut a straight line or a line through here. Um, I need these provinces so I can attack them. But you guys actually, Sendai just became a lot less important. We're not going to conquer you just because to conquer you. We want to fight our way through the Timurid, so because they open up. They open up contact with them. And then we can start working our way through the Ottomans. And the Mamluk. War with the Ottomans is going to be fun, fun. So. Your old father, Barry. <laughs> It's definitely going to be something that we So maybe by like 1650 we'll be into Europe. I don't know. That's that's probably 100 years from now. Because it's 1550. 1650, we'll see. We may snake a line of provinces. It doesn't look amazing, but you know, if it gets your job done. Continuing to give us new people to attack. I'm just surprised you. I guess the uh, coalition fell apart because nobody fired it. Is that how that works? Did they? It's been a while. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call this here. It's a good stopping point in the middle of a war. And I thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, Red Hunter out.